to my channel. I'm your favorite doctor Sethiya today again with a new pick up piloting and today's topic you already know we are gonna be knowing the message from your future self. So from the future you are giving messages to your present self like this is a trying timeless reading my darling so whenever wherever you're watching this video at that point of time in this point of time that you're clicking on this video what your future self, you yourself, is telling right now to your present self, okay? Right now, whatever your situation is, whatever you are trying to manifest, whatever you're trying to get rid of, so whatever your need is, whatever your desire is, so what your future self, what you are telling yourself right now, you from the future is literally giving yourself messages for the present situation okay my darling i hope you understand today's topic so my darling if you're new to my channel have no idea what is going on let me tell you i am an intuitive reader. i use my intuition and magical power to channel messages from angels and universe to guide you guys and my darling this is purely intuitive best reading trust your intuition trust your gut feelings in order to choose the perfect group for yourself and if you're drawn to more than one group feel free to choose this group my darling maybe you got some extra messages from angels and universe right so <clears throat> this is my beautiful pile number one beauty way that is card number four this is my pile number one don't worry i'll give you a beautiful closure look that you already will find in the description box Pile number two is the ancient one, card number one, the ancient ones. This is pile number two. And this is my pile number three, the tree of life, card number 58. Wow. Okay. So my darlings, it's time for a beautiful, beautiful closure look so that you can choose the perfect group for yourself, right? So do this. Darling, you choose the perfect group for yourself. I'll give the timestamps in the description box. Go there, click on the timestamps, and the video will give you the exact timing when your pile is going to be started. And my darlings, if you're not into my soul drive, go ahead, subscribe to my channel, and hit that bell icon so that you get notified by YouTube whenever I upload new videos. And if you're interested in, then go to my channel and their community tab. There will you will find pick an image reading, like there is four image, and to pick one or two, or whatever you are drawn to then swipe to get your own personalized message and i every day upload this indian standard time 7 a.m so i hope like you guys already know it is someone new here so please don't forget to check that out and my darlings currently i'm not offering personal reading so when i will be offering in the future i will make a post don't worry about it okay my darling so let's go jump into your reading Hello my darlings, amazing group number one. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So you choose this amazing beauty way card. So first of all, I can feel this. This card is all about the beauty way invites you, my group number one, to create beauty in your life and to recognize the beauty inside yourself and in others. Stop to smell the roses, take a deep breath, look up to the star and recognize the splendor that surrounds you. See the beauty in whatever situation you find yourself in and you will receive the lesson that life is teaching you in a kind and gentle way. So I am getting my pile number one. You are someone that universe already gave you lots of lesson, lots of teachings in a very beautiful way. Also, your future self is telling you that the waiting is going on in the present situation at the point of time you're watching this video because life is literally checking that if you have learned all the lesson that you need to learn before meeting the person or before achieving the ultimate success in your life or not so my darlings if you're someone like i'm getting there is two group of people first one group literally want to have a great job great career and second they want to get married okay so i'm getting that if you're in a first group that you want to get a job or a career or something success in your money in your richness i'm getting that's coming in your way but before that you need to 
understand that which path is not yours you need to feel some you need to go through some failures so that you can understand the true beauty the true passion comes from your heart okay and for the second one i'm getting your future self that you from the future telling yourself that don't worry about the marriage don't worry about the person when where why how you're going to be meeting the one or how the relationship will unfold that will be super surprising for you so your future self is right now telling you that enjoy the surroundings that you are right now in and try to find out the beautiful things that right now life lovingly presenting you and also i'm giving that <clears throat> you choose this amazing card you know that is also telling you that stop trying to fix relationships that you already believe that are broken recognize that things are exactly as they need to be in this moment and acknowledge the inherent beauty in that when you understand this you will be able to bring about the change you want do not engage in gossip about darkness or flaws of others be careful not to be seduced by the superficial beauty of a project or relationship you are toying with unless you are willing to pay a price for it later so i'm getting your future self is right now trying to tell you uh, that you know don't pay attention to the superficial beauty so if you're really gonna be choosing someone by only looking at their money or by only looking at their you know status or family relation no don't do that maybe life was literally a bit um giving you lots of lesson or giving you lots of teaching because maybe you have a tendency my group number one that you choose people uh in a relationship or you choose the work that you want to do because of the glamour outside so maybe right now you are going to the transformation when you will find out that it's okay to have a glamorous world it's okay to have a glamorous outside but you need to have a big and beautiful heart to be with me so pile number one you're going to be literally valuing people's love people affection towards you more than their money or more than their outer expression more so that is exactly your future self is trying to tell you that in the future you will find the exact perfect person with some qualities that is a new for you that you literally don't know that you always wanted those type of qualities in your person or in your job in your career maybe you're going to be literally making career out of something that is completely different the from the way that you always wanted to have it okay so some differences is here some new things are here because i can see the dragonfly right so dragonfly is a symbol of transformation dragonfly is a symbol of something new that is going to be changing your whole perspective the way you look the world everything is going to change my group number one so expect a new change that is exactly entering in your life very soon your future self is already telling you that your life is like a lotus no matter where you are born no matter how muddy your present situation is you will be treated like a queen of all flowers you will be treated like a most spiritual most beautiful and most majestic and spiritual flower ever that is the lotus you know lotus literally go to the vishnu's lotus feet right lotus go to the lord shiva so i am sensing that no matter where you born maybe it's muddy maybe maybe it's dirt but let me tell you your destination is somewhere that is very much blissful that is very much spiritual so group number one i can see huge transformation huge transition you know mentally spiritually uh, if you say materially yes i can see a huge glow up a huge transformation is coming in your way and you're going to be leveling up yourself your future self is telling you that in the future you are going to be sitting in the throne that you have always wanted okay so what your future self is trying to tell you i am getting the ripeness is here that is the nine of pentacles so i can see money i can see richness i can see lots of abundance i can see that your future self is telling you be ready to achieve the fruit that you already saw in your life so i'm giving this a time for getting your karma back my group number one so whatever your karma is you're gonna be getting back in this timeline like your future self is telling you that you're gonna be getting your good karma you're gonna be getting your 
positive karma because you have done lots of good things to achieve something new and it is time for you that universe is literally showering you with lots of blessings and gifts and when you're going to be receiving those gifts don't think that this is just your luck that you're having it no it's you are having it because you deserve it my group number one no matter what your luck is if people are really truly trying to tell you in the future that it's just your luck it's just your good fortune that you are here in this place it's not just your luck my group number one you have worked for it okay you have done lots of work you have done lots of prayer manifestation for this thing and you are just getting the result so i'm getting a long awaited wish your old wish is literally coming true with the nine of pentacles that is the ripeness you are ready to have a love fest you are ready to get into that harvest okay like you are ready to get your result um, from the place that you are literally putting lots of effort in it's time for you to reap the fruit that you have always wanted it's a very happy time luxurious time i can feel that lots of luxurious and money that you're gonna be enjoying in the future and will be having the dream lifestyle that you've always wanted then you got the card that is the creativity that is a number three empress card for me but also number three here creativity it's kind of a giving me three of cups energy for me creativity means that you're going to be creating the life that you have always wanted your future self is telling you that if you are right now worried that if your manifestation is working or not or if you know your dream marriage dream career or you know the way you want to design your life that is exactly going to work for your not. So that is a big yes, my group number one. Yes, yes, yes. The way you always wanted to make your dream live, the way you always wanted to live your day and night, the way you always wanted to look at yourself in the front of mirror, those days are near, okay? You're gonna be literally will be in the throne because you choose the beauty way. So your beauty is coming in your way because you are ready to achieve that beauty because you are not so superficial anymore i can feel lots of self-growth is going on also you are clearing lots of karmic debt in this year okay my group number one whenever you're watching this video you're clearing lots of karmic debt you're clearing lots of karmic relationships or clearing past karma from your life that was literally giving you lots of heartbreaks lots of hurdles and trouble i am feeling that you are literally creating your life that you have always wanted so if you are from the creative fields like you know singing dancing or entertainment field or into the spirituality or you know painting or somewhere where creativity is very much needed like writing or um like writing lyrics or building something i can feel be more creative because i can feel lotus is also here so maybe lotus is connected to the spirituality and spiritual awakening that you are literally tapping into it and you are becoming um like you are getting a recognition okay you're becoming famous in your neighborhood or in your area whatever your criteria is you are getting famous of your own thing of your own talent that's also coming towards you then you got the card going with the flow that is very much needed okay maybe go with the flow is the main guidance for you from your future self your future self is telling you that do not overpower anything or do not try to control your life when it seems like it is uncontrollable because i can feel my group number one you are going to achieve lots of uncontrolled changeness lots of transformation that you cannot even control and cannot even predict and cannot even deny it and cannot even make it slower it has to happen you need to let go of something you need to embrace a new situation okay so i'm feeling like going with the flow may be the best choice for you right now so if you feel like you are stuck you are not stuck maybe this is the right time for you to being stuck in a situation because universe is literally making you uh, re-energize making you save some more energy because the the upcoming challenges that you're going to be facing that is not necessarily bad challenges that may be a very good thing that you need to learn in order to get you know success in the future but i can see my group number one whatever you are trying to manifest that thing is also attracting you so maybe like a beautiful quote for you that i don't chase i attract 
whatever I desire, that desires me more. So this is exactly those lines for you, my group number one. I can feel that going with the flow and whatever you, you want to create for your life, that is happening for you because you have done lots of good karma. I can see group number one, you are a very good soul to get this kind of a result. Then you got past lives. Definitely, this is the moon card for me. You are becoming more intuitive, more more psychic. Maybe you have already met lots of people from the past life. Or maybe in this lifetime you have met or you will be meeting lots of people who, who you have already dealt with in the past life. So some sort of past karma was there that needs to clear. So I'm getting in this year or whenever you are watching this video, you are clearing this past life karmic debt and making new, new, new karma or you know adding some new action into your life into your soul that I can feel and also my group number one if you feel that you are a psychic you you are having that intuitive quality that's true my group number one because I can feel you can connect with the with your ancestor very easily so try to follow your own ancestor and try to follow your own gut feelings sometimes your ancestors are trying to give you some dreams or trying to give you some inner voice why do you need to just follow your inner voice your future self is telling you that you are not alone in this journey you got your ancestors your guardian angel your guardian demon always watching over you maybe you cannot even see them but they are always watching you protecting you so you are not alone okay so my group number one if you're feeling alone if you're feeling like nobody is understanding what problem that you're going through that's not true i can feel your future self is telling you that hey you're not alone you know we are are already protected and guided so wherever you are right now wherever you will be in the future that's all protected you will never face any kind of and you will never face any kind of problem in those areas then i can feel the stress is here that is seven of wand and that stress is basically useless and meaningless because can you feel the man is literally balancing himself on a balloon and there is a monkey and the mon the monkey is having a pin on his hand the man is literally tensed because the man is literally balancing on a balloon and the man is thinking that the monkey will punch this balloon and the man will fall to the death but the thing is monkey don't have any iq level monkey literally not intelligent like human beings monkey literally don't know how to use the pin to destroy the balloon so it's completely useless for you to tense about your future that is exactly your future self is telling you that if you're literally feeling that you're very much stressful that i don't know what to do like i'm so much like feeling stress like, I don't know if my future is literally going to be bright, full or not. Whatever I'm manifesting, whatever I'm trying to get, I don't know if I'm able to get this or not. If you're feeling my group number one, that's useless. Those overthinking is useless. Useless. You don't need to think over, okay? The more you think over, the more you're going to be making your energy complex. So, please let go of this overthinking. Let go of this stress that is exactly draining your energy. So, some negativity or failures that you, you were facing in the past or maybe you're facing right now, that was all because of this past life karma. So, that some karma literally hit hard, right, my darling? So, just bear with it because i can feel you're almost uh, ending these cycles and opening a new one for some of you you already closed that chapter already and you know, completed all of your date and you are in a new journey in a new chapter so group number one whoever choose this pile you guys are in a new cycle and in this new cycle lots of new things are coming in your way maybe you will feel like many people from the past coming in your life and they are very much shocked by looking at your success your future self is telling you because that meant to be okay you meant to be like an like, like a beautiful lotus okay uh, then you got the turning in that is four of cups for, for me my darling you are literally becoming more self-confidence and self-aware your future self is telling you that you are literally gonna be achieving a state of your mind where you are literally not gonna be bothered by other people's opinion about you anymore you will never be bothered anymore about other people's criticism about other people's comments because you know how to shut their mouth up you 
know how to close your ears and you know how to listen to your own intuition. You know how to listen to your own gut feelings. So your future self is definitely telling you you're becoming more mature. You're becoming more powerful in yourself. Nobody can control you unless it is you. Also, let me tell you, I can see that you're becoming successful in your career because I can see an individual who is very much happy being bachelor, who is very much happy being uh, independent in their own way and having that amazing free life because within nine of pentacles that is ripeness I can feel my group number one you are someone you are like a bird you you love to you know fly freely without any hesitation that exactly you are achieving my group number one so if you're literally looking for a job career money I don't care but maybe you're really literally gonna be getting that amazing career or maybe your parents or someone is literally giving you that opportunity where you're gonna be enjoying lots of luxuriousness and again if you're literally looking for marriage, I can see your future self is telling you that in this marriage, you feel your freedom, you're independent, you're not dependent on your partner. Like you got your own aura, you got your own power in this relationship. You will never be dominated by your person. There is equal give and take in your relationship. And if you're literally asking about your health, because I can feel you're literally stressed about something that is not necessarily a uh, thing to th you know overthink about, but I'm getting your health health is literally healing that is literally becoming more powerful and please my darling i don't know why you are literally getting tensed uselessly don't don't overthink uh, about a situation okay don't overthink because i can see that my group number one sometimes you're overthinking that is basically unnecessary for you so let's go see that what your future self is telling you uh, wow, the father is here, card number two. So this is also for me, like high priestess card. I can see double vision. I can see uh, that there is a uh, spirituality. There is also a time that is having lots of beautiful material world and um, like material wealth and spiritual wealth coming together. With the father card, I can hear someone is having strong divine masculine energy into themselves. So maybe my group number one, you will try to find out that you are actually having lots of action-oriented energy in yourself. Like you can be a very great father or you can literally, maybe you are a female watching this video, but you've got an amazing cool mother type of energy okay like you can literally handle any situation with your cool mind you will never be getting you know super hot or hot tempered like i don't know maybe patience is something or sustainability commitment is something that is going to be very strong in yourself and you'll find out that you are not desperate anymore to be to be in a relationship or to become a rich person you are not desperate you are enjoying every stage of your life from your future self you're also telling right now to your present self that do not worry about um about your family do not worry about your current situation whatever you are in because i am sensing that if you're literally going through some sort of bad situation that thing will be literally turning into a very good situation and if you're already having very good situation then i'm getting you are literally finding lots of balance in yourself where you know how to please yourself or how to give pleasure to yourself Wow, I got the Eros card. Let me tell you, you are becoming seductive, sexy, okay? You are literally embracing lots of sexy quality in yourself. You are becoming beautiful, transformation, okay? Because Eros card is all about sexy, sexual health is going to be very amazing, looking seductive. People are addicted to towards you. People are watching you. You know, they can't get enough of you. You are getting unforgettable beauty. You are becoming beautiful, sexy, glow up, you know, huge glow up. Your skin is glowing. Your hair is growing. You're looking beautiful. If you're literally going to the gym, then I can see you will see your result. If you're trying to do some health or if you're really trying to to do some type, some type of you know beauty tip or something like homemade beauty tip or buying something to make yourself more beauty i think that is literally working skincare hair care or something like your body type you are literally doing something and that is literally working okay um if you're literally trying to buy some jewelry i can see some diamonds jewelry coming in your way to make yourself more beautiful and luxurious with this two card i can feel that 
um, you are someone you look like you will be looking like a very rich person okay like people will have that rich rich vibe from you that exactly your future self is telling you that maybe you don't even understand or maybe you don't even feel that way but I am getting your future self is telling you you are becoming very uh, richy rich looking okay then you got the card that is the thread. This thread is also telling me like twin flame journey for some of you. Maybe you are literally pulling towards a journey that is unknown towards you. That is very much unknown to you. Maybe you don't even know that why you are going through some sort of situation. Or maybe you are going to be meeting lots of people through your destiny and it feels like, oh my God, maybe it's written in the star that I'm meeting. With the trade card for some of you, this is like two meaning. You are cutting lots of cords that is not serving you anymore. Or you are making lots of new friends. That is going to be uh, a new, new, new experience for you, new enjoyment for you. So uh, also I can see my group number one. If you are from Rainbow Family, if you're like lesbian, gay, I can feel maybe you're going to be having a new partner or you're going to be having those people, those friends, those family members who is going to be supporting whatever you want to do. Also with the trade, I can feel like you are someone, you are becoming... Um, the mediocre who is literally helping other people to come together in a stage in a place where others can have a very good family so maybe you are literally becoming a high position or getting high position in your job or becoming the boss captain or the main leader of your group okay so if you're literally in a school or college and i'm getting you're literally going to be the secretary or you know those type of uh like student union i can feel like if you are someone i don't know maybe some leadership quality captainship qualities you're in your workplace or maybe in your family okay people are gonna be listening to you or you will be able to you know make peace in in those situation so from your future self i can feel that you are so strong that you can pull anything towards yourself whatever makes you feel good so you are someone you can literally make anything manifest because you are a master manifester and your manifestation is working as well so what else what your future self is telling you more the bad girl spirit be fearless and bold so you need to be more fearless more bold because your future self is telling you that you don't even know that people get scared of you when you are into yourself when you are just carrying with your own aura own energy People are getting scared of this energy. So embrace your energy, my group number one. Then you got the Raven, sorry, White Raven Spirit, Trust in the Magic, card number 66. Okay, this is also, it's amazing. It is card number four, Bad Girl Spirit, and you choose the beauty way that is also number four. So maybe you're going to be seeing lots of four, four, four. That is also a sign that your future self is telling you that whatever you are trying to manifest, that exactly at the door. With the you know, White Raven Spirit card number 66, trust in the magic, your manifestation, your magic is working. Also, my group number one, no one can hex you. No one can put any kind of evil energy into your soul because I can feel you are superly uh, powerful and you can control dark power. Like you can control over your jealousy, over your argument, over your angerness. Like you can control all the dark energies around you. Like dark energies fade away whenever you are there. You are having the cat spirit, my group number one. Okay, your aura is so strong, no negative energy can fight with you. Also, you are superly protected with your ancestors because past life with the white raven they're connected with your ancestors you got a very strong ancestor power that is protecting you all the way around chameleon spirit act as in card number 14 that is exactly telling me my group number one that you will be able to change your personality depending on the situation or in another word you are becoming more flexible more adaptable than before that is also one of your transformation or one of the power of your magic that you can literally change your decision change your aura change the way you look change your characteristic depending on the situation and that is exactly going to help you to achieve to get success in whatever field you need so maybe you really didn't even know that how adjustable you are until you get into those kind of situations so it's lots of 
self uh, exploration going on you'll be knowing your little talent in this way you're going to be literally appreciating all those lessons all the situation that universe lovingly present to you so all the way i can see that all is well my group number one so no matter what you are going through you will be getting success and your future self is very happy that you got those lessons because that was very much necessary for you to understand that how much lucky you are or lucky you will be in the future that's all i got for you my group number one i hope you like this video give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon so that you're gonna be notified by youtube whenever i upload new videos comment down below which part is resulting with you also suggest me kind of topic i'll definitely do that till then stay blessed and happy i love you guys so much hello my amazing group number two welcome to my channel so you choose this amazing card that is the ancient ones Card number one. First of all, my group number two, let me tell you one thing. Your future self is not here alone today with you. You also got your ancestors. You also got your spirit guides, your spirit animals today. That is going to be giving you lots of messages because I can feel that... You are an old soul, my group number two. You are an so old soul. Like maybe you are 10,000 years old soul, okay? Maybe you are someone who already have walked in this earth to your past families, to your past life reincarnation. You have made lots of people. You have uh, lived here. So you already know how to act or how to behave with people maybe you are a fast learner maybe you literally learn anything very fast or you love many languages you love to travel the world or it feels like you know how people are going to be behaving when they're going through this type of situation that's why you are very much intuitive that's why you already know what they're going to be telling you next because it's just your experience that you already have because you have lived lots of lots of lots of life here in this earth you are not a new soul you are an old soul my group number two okay so this card is all about like the ancient ones are inviting you my group number two to reach to the future to help birth a new destiny for the earth Go ahead, find out who you are becoming 10,000 years from now. If you accept the invitation, great power and blessing will come your way and allow you to craft a new destiny for yourself. Do not hesitate to bite off more than you can chew because you have unlimited spiritual resources available here right now. I can feel my darling, these ancient ones, can see you that you are here not alone okay like not forgiving an ancestor is keeping you from the freedom you seek remember this is no longer your karma you can break the chain that once bound you to the family drama and be free for your generational curses forgive the ones you need to release honor your biological ancestors by lighting a candle to them tonight i can feel my group number two maybe you've got an ancestral curse or maybe you were dealing with that ancestral curse it's maybe poverty it's maybe some sort of physical disease it's maybe like bad luck in uh, love or something like okay like maybe there was something that was called ancestral curse in your in your ancestors okay maybe from father's side mother's side there was a curse but you are here you are literally here in this earth, you born in this family, you select this family to born because you are here to clear your ancestor's karma. You are here to break the chain, you are here to make your family free from any kind of cars. My group number one, maybe you are the one, the first billionaire in your, in your family. You are the whole one who will be marrying the intercursed for the first time. You are the one who will be doing the rainbow things for the first time. You are the one who will be doing uh, or who will be literally getting married to a different religion, to a different country, to a person completely different from you. You are the one that is going to be making career into something new that was not uh, from your ancestors. You are the one here changing the whole... Um, ancestral kind of a calendar you are here to break all the rules break all the chains that was binding you down that was weighing you and your parents down 
to not get success i am getting that you are here to cut all the cords cut all the chain so that you guys can fly and catch the amazing opportunities that is coming towards you your future self is telling you that my darling my group number to whoever watching this video you are here for a reason and the reason is you are here to make all of these family members and all of these souls make them free you are here because you are the creator of the new destiny of yourself you're not gonna be following your father's path your mother's path or your ancestor's path you are going to be making your new path so you are the creator you are the new one you are the new fresh air that your family and everyone is going to be enjoying so you are someone completely different my group number two okay so your future self is already telling you that my group number two don't worry about when everyone is telling you you are different you're weird you stand out be like that you don't have to follow everyone okay you don't have to follow your mother you don't have to follow your father you don't have to follow the orders that they are giving you follow your passion so i am feeling like my group number two you are someone you got your heart your passion into one thing and your parents want you to become something else so for in this case i am feeling that go with the flow and trust your own passion don't follow your mother or father because i am here telling you because your future self is telling you that you are here to break all the family chain all the curses and breaking all the chains that was weighing your families down okay so be the first one to break all the rules okay and be the first one to change the way your your parents look at the world the way you have looked at the world so you got the turning in energy amazing four of cups and the first card is already telling me that you are here closing your eyes into the meditative state and other people are literally trying to manipulate you and you're not listening to them that's exactly what you need to do your future self is telling you that if you are someone my group number two you need to be uh, like you want to be a doctor but your family literally telling you that no you cannot be a doctor or vice versa you want to be a singer and families are telling you that no you need to be a doctor then don't follow that try to follow your own passion because it's your life it's your destiny it's your luck okay so no matter how much you try to follow your parents you try to follow others you will come back to your own purpose because that's what life is okay because let me tell you one thing my own story i always wanted to become a professor but look at that now here i am with my spiritual stuff okay and i'm doing great i'm literally having fun and my families are literally supporting me after that okay so exactly my darling so don't worry about that just go with the flow whatever your purpose is your your purpose will find you okay your purpose will find you because maybe right now you don't even know that how creative you are or how uh, powerful you are in a field that you literally don't even know that maybe in the future you will be dealing with those fields and trying to know that oh my god i'm based at it and for that i don't need to give lots of effort effortlessly i am talented in that place so my group number two your future self is telling you that it's time for you to close your eyes okay and deep dive into yourself and try to find out that what you are good at because it's time for you to make yourself successful do not fall for other people's opinion try to follow your own intuition so maybe it's a very small insignificant thing that you feel like that you you are good at try to do that maybe that insignificant thing will make you famous okay who knows my darling okay <laughs> who knows michael jackson was also someone who was like a street dancer but look at that <laughs> okay so yeah uh, then you got the creative video. Oh my God, I didn't even see the card, but now I got the creative video. So uh, try to follow your own heart. That is exactly your future self is telling you because your future self already know that you will be very famous in the future. I don't know. Maybe you are someone you want to get famous 
recognition other people's appreciation support or becoming a model or like you know like in the public eye that is exactly your dream is maybe exactly that you're going through or maybe if you're someone you want to marry a very famous person and getting famous by that maybe also you are manifesting this so maybe when you are sharing your thoughts with your families with your with your other friends people are telling you hey don't just live in the dream that is impossible you cannot get married to that person or you cannot get that life because that's like so dreamy darling we dream because our soul wants us to know because that is our purpose okay so don't listen to other people maybe i can see you have lots of toxic people who are very much jealous of you maybe you don't even know that but don't feed yourself with those negativity okay try to motivate yourself try to look at the light side that you have in yourself then you got this stress exactly if you're drawn to group one please go and see the card group one because i can feel this three card was also in group number one the stress is literally telling me look at that the man is literally on the uh, balloon having the balance and the monkey is having the pin the man is getting tensed because the man is thinking that the monkey will punch the balloon and this man will fall and die but the man has no idea that monkey is not so intelligent like the human being so monkey will never know how to use the pin so they will never punch the balloon but the tension that is useless so maybe like people will try to give you some pessimistic thinking that your future self is telling you that people might try to tell you that is impossible for you to do something that is your dream is but don't listen to them don't make yourself into useless thinking that is not even working okay try to follow your own creativity no matter how little that is follow your own creativity and then oh my god we are the world that is the 10 number 10 that is 10 of pentacles okay so we are the world 10 of pentacles that is already telling me you are someone you're going to be very famous in your neighborhood in your in your area in your community in the internet in whatever you are doing people are appreciating you you're going to be getting into a huge 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 team i don't know maybe you're going to be doing some teamwork some group work some social work or helping other people to raise their vibration to live raise their livelihood maybe you'll be literally doing some sort of social work or um like having amazing gr a group of dancers or uh, you are just having a group of people who is doing lots of drama in this in, a, in the show okay like i don't know maybe artist a group of artists a group of musicians Maybe you are someone, okay, a group leader, okay, so I'm getting, we are the world, maybe you're going to be collaborating with lots of people and making the world a better place, that is exactly your purpose, maybe right now you don't know what your purpose is or your future self is telling you that, hey, are you getting worried about what your purpose is in this lifetime or what your career is? Don't worry about it. You will find out very soon. Or literally, if you're thinking about marriage or about your family life, then I'm getting through your work, through your life purpose, you will meet your future spouse. Or through the thing that you want to love or through your passion, okay? Whatever your passion is, whatever you like to go, wherever you like to go whatever you like to do through that you'll be meeting your person online offline doesn't matter but the day you're gonna be meeting your person will be very happy because you are doing something that you like to do okay so uh if you're asking that if you will be successful and rich in the future or not then i am getting you are successful you are rich and you are very much famous in the future your future self is telling you that you'll be having a fan base in the future you'll be getting lots of people's appreciation but for that you need to do whatever that makes you feel happy so for that my darling try to find out your talent try to find out what you're good at okay mm. okay the guilt is here that is ego sword i am feeling my darling maybe you are someone 
Oh my God, you don't want to make other people, especially your parents, feel bad about you. Okay, so okay, so you you are in a very confused situation. So maybe your passion is something your parents are not understanding. What your parents are understanding, you are not understanding your parents. Okay, so maybe there is some sort of like you don't even know what you need to do. So if you're going to that kind of eight of sword, then open your eyes. Okay, like you're closing and thinking lots of negative things. All right, people are literally giving you. Negative thinking that oh my god you cannot even do that you know come out of this you cannot even do that if they are telling you my darling block them don't listen to them because i can feel you've got lots of toxic friends toxic people in your life that is you know constantly pulling you down so i am feeling that open your eyes and don't share your next plan to other people because I can feel whatever your next plan is that is gonna be making you successful so whatever your next plan is don't share it with other people do see things secretly maybe you are a secret superstar maybe you're gonna be becoming successful in your career marriage job success health or changing your physical look or attracting anything you'll be successful in anything whatever you are doing in secret so secrecy is something that is going to be helping you to get whatever you want so don't literally tell your next plan to other people okay my group number two that is also a guidance for you keep your plan to yourself or keep your uh, you know super secret plannings or super secret tips to yourself so your future self is telling you that you don't need to worry about what other people are going to be thinking about you or what other people are doing because it's all about you. What you are doing, what you are thinking, that's what matters, okay? Because in the future, even your family members will be supporting you. Even family members will be telling you that I'm sorry that we were not able to understand that you are so you will be so successful in the future. I'm sorry for that. So don't worry about that, okay? Try to follow your own passion about the thing that you are very much happy to do it maturity is here that is ace of pentacle so i can feel my group number two you are becoming more mature and your future self is very mature self okay your future self is way too mature than you are maybe you will be literally understanding the whole lot of lesson whole lot of situation and ultimately you will understand that what <clears throat> or who i was talking about about those people about those friends maybe at the point of time you will be getting success in the future you will lose a lot of friends you will lose a lot of people from your life because you will understand that they were not supporting you they were not feeling happy that you are getting success in your life so my group number two <clears throat> though you're gonna be having lots of lovers that lots of appreciator lots of supporter you will also have lots of haters you will also have lots of people who in who get envious of your success and those are specifically your so-called college friends or school friends okay it's very bad like i literally you know somehow i feel very sad that when uh we call that is our so-called friend and everything and they feel very jealous and feel upset about our success it's very bad right my darling so i'm getting exactly that is going to happen with you like people some people will be like you know very much jealous of your tremendous success that you're really getting and whatever you are doing people can see what you are doing my pal number two so if you're literally one of your influencer want to be a star or someone that you're doing that people can see okay um, doesn't matter if it's only on the internet or not maybe you are doing something that where people can see you physically or people can see you on the internet okay like people can see your work and that's why they are getting lots of jealous so your future self is telling you that please don't get stressed over other people's thinking and if you're someone waiting for your result okay waiting for your exam results or something and people are telling that you know i was getting the rumors that uh, these uh, are not so good or those subjects are not so good you no know, these are very bad don't listen to them okay maybe this is only their perspective that may not be good or bad for you so don't listen to other people try to listen to yourself okay it is a time for you to listen to yourself don't listen to others only listen to the people who you are loving and who you understand that they are unconditionally loving you okay but i am feeling like some friends or some that you really know them as neighbors they are really getting sucks they don't want good things for you okay 
So try to find out a lot of information before trusting anybody else. That is also like warning for you. So what your future self is telling you? The ocean. Maybe you are literally you know, having amazing travel to the ocean, having a journey. Also, ocean is telling me that diving into that deep secret of yourself, deep secret of that how you feel or diving into the spirituality diving into your emotional thing my pal number two if you want to be an empath or a terror leader or a psychic the door is opening for you if you want to connect with the other dimensions you will be connecting with them as well you're becoming more emotional and more empathetic where you can literally feel other people's emotion you are becoming more strongly um uh, like psychologist kind of energy okay psychopath not psychopath like you can feel when other people are literally becoming psychopath okay because look i am not um talking about any psychological issue but i am t talking about that you know those people who are mentally not so uh positive very much you know negative and pessimistic but in the future, you will understand when people are positive and when people are negative. So you, you're going to be having those you know, ideas that how to choose good friend for yourself. So maybe you're going to be literally cutting lots of cords and making lots of new friends. Also with the ocean, ocean means purity. Ocean means what goes around that comes around. Ocean means whatever you give that you will receive. So I am getting that you're going to be receiving lots of abundance, success, lots of good fortune because you give other people lots of positive energy. So your future self is already telling you that maybe my group number two, you will meet your uh, true purpose when you are connecting with the spirituality or when you are connecting with your own uh, own self okay try to find out your own body try to find out your own self with the ocean card i can also see ocean is very much connected with the water energy water means the in energy that is very much purification loving yourself enjoying yourself and try to find out that why you are different it's like the unconscious mind the depth that incomprehensible okay so the ocean displays every emotion without shame to witness its glassy moonlight oh my god its unforgiving storms is to know the full spectrum of the human experience i can feel that you know study waves touch their surface get in the water no matter where you live each drop is a part of whole the ocean is in every tear deeper than deep big dreams and discovery so in the future your future self is telling you that my group number two you're going to be achieving a big dream that looks like impossible that looks like oh my god it's like a dream it's impossible for anyone to be live into to live in that dream but you are getting it you're making your dream real does it it, it is not impossible for you anymore my group number two, I'm getting impossible things are becoming possible for you. Okay, the nectar is here. Well, it's a very sexual card to get. So I can see there are some romances here. So definitely my group number two are trying to find out your counterpart. So I'm getting you will eventually found your counterpart. You eventually found your divine partner. And I can see that before you find your true future spouse okay so if you're literally finding in love because i can feel that you're finding your love or someone in love interest is here so maybe before that you're going to be touching your darkness you're going to be understanding that what is the negative side of yourself you know those pessimistic uh, those pessimism that you perceive from other people those pessimistic things are already in yourself so you will try to heal that first so lots of shared work is going on that my group number two will be doing before you're going to be meeting this person also with the nectar you'll find that you are more nurturing than before and you deserve to have a romantic life you deserve to have a very sexual romantic life with your person so i'm getting a person with lots of you know Oh my god sexual desire towards you they're entering in your life it's not super lusty but i can see lust is something that is going to be making uh, this connection more powerful and then the love is literally entering into your life so love and lust coming exactly same way my group number two so your future self is telling you that 
so it's not that you are only discovering yourself through that you will discovering your own true counterpart and you will also have lust and love together at the same page then you got the warrior you are a warrior okay maybe you are an aries or a taurus watching my video maybe you got a very strong aura in yourself and you can fight back so you are you are someone that you don't get worried when other people are literally trying to fight with you you can fight back you are a fighter you are a warrior okay like you are someone if others are trying to bully you you bully them in return okay if someone is trying to suppress your uh, aura you are gonna be blasting their mind okay you are gonna be making them pay for it so my group number two maybe you don't even know that how controlling and how powerful how fierceful you are maybe you don't even know my group number two that your future self is telling you that you make other people feel scared of your presence okay people feel a bit insecure when you are there uh doing something people feel insecure because of your aura because of your beauty because of your energy you are super powerful that makes other people people feel that they are powerless in front of you your future self is also telling you that my group number two you will definitely have a person who will be superly clingy towards you okay you're gonna be literally attracting a clingy future life partner towards you and who will be supporting you and maybe will be literally doing lots of work with you so maybe uh meeting this person through work meeting this person through something that you love to do or they love to do maybe same likes and dislike is here okay let's see what else here okay okay so you got the zero spirit see the big picture so a person i can see this is a person coming towards you who are tall a tall person coming towards you will be having a very prominent eyelashes big eyes and they will be very philosophical having a great mind okay always look at the bigger picture don't worry about the future don't worry about what other people are going to be thinking about them and they don't worry about something that was not necessary for them to understand the zero spirit is all about see the bigger picture don't get lost in little things don't feel disappointed in um initial disappointments okay so i'm getting that like your future self is telling you that you are someone you will be encountering with the some with the with, with a person who is having these qualities also with the zero spirit i can feel your future self is telling you that you are becoming tall so if you're literally trying to you know raise your height okay for some of you okay it's like a general reading you know you're becoming taller you're becoming skinnier. you're gonna be having long legs or something like that your eyes are becoming beautiful also you're becoming more philosophical and more open-minded about the relationship about the life okay so maybe you are not shallow minded anymore in the future so from your future self you are telling yourself that hey you know what in the future my part number two you will not be a shallow minded anymore you're gonna be literally having lots of big acceptance about the society okay because you know that we are just a living human being temporary human being in this world so what's more so you got the porcupine spirit time for beginner's mind so i can feel maybe you're gonna be learning something new your future self is telling you that maybe you'll be learning something new language new uh culture new something that you're learning and you are kind of protecting yourself so crazily that no one can come to you or uh, it's very much difficult for other people to get that amazing friendship with you so time for beginner's mind maybe it's time for you to become more traditional more i know oh my god more exclusive and more internal to understand that how things works so maybe you're literally you know you, you are you're trying to learn something new yeah something new is here learning something new or having a new connection where you feel lots of shyness okay in, in initial stages of this connection yeah <clears throat> these things are happening for you also one card let's go see what your future self is telling you 
okay koi fear spirit there is always enough so if you feel like you don't have enough money enough people to love you or enough good situation to have a fortunate life that is a lie my group number two i can feel your future self is telling you that in the future there is always enough you will feel that i got enough money enough friends enough love or enough good situation to live a happy healthy life so enough spirituality knowledge or koi fish spirit is something that koi fish can literally live in the land more than uh, one or two hour without water okay so koi fish are like in a survival kind of energy they got in themselves so i can feel maybe your you, your future self is telling you that you know what you got enough okay you you got like enough to live a happy healthy life to live a, a life that is not depending on others okay i am feeling that my darling my group number two self-love is very much important to attract this person that you are really attracting and also if you are attracting a person you will feel shy in front of them but those person will feel very comfortable to express their feelings to you also you are literally entering into the cycle that your future self is telling you that be ready to embrace new situation and be also very much protected my group number two protection is something that is going to be very important for you in this reading so try to protect your soul protect your energy do not eat anything that others are giving you to eat okay so check everything because i can feel you got lots of enemies okay you know try to use uh black obsidian selenite or any other crystal that can protect you you know try to drink lemon juice okay try to clear yourself okay to protect yourself because that is very much needed you got lots of people's eye on yourself that's got uh, that's all i got for you my group number two if you like this video give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel hit that by hit that bell icon so that you can notified by youtube when i upload new videos and my channel is comment down below which part is resonating with you also so this many kind of topic i'll definitely do that till the step of the i love you so much hello my amazing pile number three so welcome 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 this is your reading you choose this amazing the tree of life reading okay so you choose the card that is the tree of life card number 58 it's amazing card isn't it oh it looks so beautiful so i am getting that this card is all about telling you to find health and balance in your life reflect on how you dance with your action your thoughts and your feelings if you are too much in your thinking head or in a world of fantasies and daydreaming connect more with your roots and physical body if you're caught in mechanical doing and you are feeling stuck not able to imagine a better life for yourself open yourself to be inspired by the heavens let your roots and branches be aligned with your heart's longings i'm getting that you know this is a tree of life that is a sacred symbol that is a sacred symbol throughout the americas right my darling it's a deep root reach into the lower world the unconscious while its branches reaches to the heavens the source of destiny to be whole in your life's journey it is important to have a deep root connection with the high branches a tall tree with shallow root will fall in the first wind but a tree with deep root can literally you know can literally you know uh, follow the storm or cannot be uprooted by the strong wind so i can feel that whatever your dream is you need to have a practical plan okay whatever you are day dreaming about you need to have a practical plan for that you know the tree of life is always telling you that you know the you know, what nutrients do you need to add to your soil to grow strong the seed of the oak will not grow on barren ground or without the light of the sun what dreams do you want to awaken to create a mindful destiny so i am getting the one thing that your future self is telling you my group number 3 follow your dreams follow your dreams and follow your dreams if you want to be someone dreamy okay if you if you have a dream to become someone then try to be that one okay try to do things that can make you that one person that you always wanted to become because i am feeling my group number 
like lots of dreams need some practical planning that your future self is telling you that hey you want to become that thing then you should work for that thing okay because i can see maybe you are literally procrastinating a lot procrastination is literally not going to help you to get whatever your dream is so mm, so have a practical plan my darling this is exactly the card is telling you and you have the potential to become whatever you want to be in the future you have the potential my group number three so maybe if you want to um get the life that you've always wanted pray for it manifest it okay ask for your angels do something okay if if it really seems like that you cannot do anything but only pray then only pray my darlings okay because prayer got lots of power let's go and see that what the cards are telling you because i can see your future self is telling you that maybe whatever your dream is whatever your wish is that already has been heard by angels and universe and angels are working so hard behind the veil so that you can get your dream so that you can get you uh, know that achieve that success that you have always wanted but my darling you need to you need to follow that okay you need to um pray for that you need to say thank you for that you need to be more grateful practice gratitude that is gonna be very helpful so first you got the card that is a tree of sword that is isolation so first of all my darling i can feel that um your future self is telling you that if you feel right now heartbroken if you feel like um something happened that broke your heart that broke your emotion that literally gave you lots of hard time it's okay it's okay to be heartbroken it's okay to feel like nothing is going to work it's okay to feel like nothing is perfect because i can feel my group number three that you know your future your, your future self is already telling you that those heartbreaks or those negative experience was very much needed for you to understand what you're going to be getting in the future mm. or three or so sometimes literally tell that maybe you are right now physically not so healthy you are right now like isolated maybe you are going through some sort of health issue if you are my darling my pile number three then don't worry that is healing okay that is healing because i can see lots of healing energy is here okay so your future self is telling you that it's okay whatever you're going through because there is healing look at the innocence is here that is the sun card because card number 19 so innocence is telling you that take a leap of faith believe the impossible something impossible is going to happen with you my group number three okay something impossible is coming in your way maybe your dream is exactly on the way after that isolation after you literally healed yourself perfectly superly then you will get that amazing present from the angels from the universe something that is exactly waiting for you waiting for you to discover them your future self is telling you that stop fighting with your own mind stop fighting with your own self stop fighting with the battle that is not yours maybe my group number three you are someone sometimes you get so annoyed by some situation something okay but those those situation is literally making you growing making you feel more mature okay my group number three because i can feel this is a mental confliction that right now you are in that right now you are going through but your future self is telling you that hey it's okay to have those mental confliction because because of this mental confliction you will understand who you are who you truly are because of this fight you will understand that how how how, how powerful you are Maybe power is something that is very much important for you. So my group number three, your future self is very much like a warrior, okay? Because to your sword, health issues, heartbreaks, breakups, failures, you know, like just quitting this type of energy you are going through. Or maybe like that was you have been in through. So your future self is telling you that it's okay, you are, you are healing from that. With the innocence that is i'm getting that you are literally gonna be getting something successful unbelievable because of your innocent power and life will lovingly present it to you universe will gift it to you with the fighting stop fighting with your own self stop fighting with your uh, past stop stop fighting with your guiltiness okay maybe you are guilty about something maybe you are literally feeling that oh my god i shouldn't have done this 
or if you're feeling that way then your future self is telling you that hey it's okay if you if you are right now in this situation it's okay for you to be in this situation maybe that that was necessary for you to heal okay what's your future self is telling you my group number three okay silence is here for me this is the star card this is the manifestation card so i can feel that you know universe literally you know give you the manifestation in a super different way i can feel that universe first will give you some sort of disappointments some type of a situation when you feel like nothing is exactly working and suddenly one day everything is exactly in the perfect place where it to be silence is here there is a star card for me and i am getting that your star your wish has been hard and you are literally getting this manifestation at the point of time when you are least expecting when you are thinking that nothing is going to work for you at that day everything exactly worked for you so your future self is telling you that do not lose hope and try to trust your own angels try to trust your own situation wherever you are in look at that the rebel i'm getting that you are someone my group number three you are gonna be getting all those revenge from your enemies from those people who were trying to challenge you or you're gonna be literally feeling that yes i have already shown the people that who exactly i am so that no one can bully me anymore or no one can judge me anymore so I'm getting the rebel energies like rebellious energy, rebel energies also that revenge taking energy, breaking all the chains, breaking all the chains and getting born again from the ash like phoenix energy. Like I will never die. I will literally show you that who I am, what my true power is. So I'm getting that if you are silent and going with the flow, if you're trusting your angels, that angels will literally give you these impossible things towards you because you believe in it. Stop fighting with your past. Stop fighting with your own pessimistic mindset. Trust it that you're going to be getting lots of revenge. I can feel my group number three. My group number three, let me tell you. Your future self is telling you that you will be getting strong revenge from your enemies, from the people who literally didn't value you, from your exes or someone who left you. They, are re they will be regretting. They will literally know banging their head on the rock that oh my god what have i done we didn't understand who pile number three is look at that experiencing that is three of ones i'm getting your experiencing will be very much fruitful and in the bottom of the deck it's crazy you got the master card okay you got the master card so definitely my group number three you are becoming the master of your own life there's like a huge changing that is coming after this healing we are literally connecting with the heaven and with the the underworld and you will make and you will manifest your dream into reality you're going to be creating your dreams into the being so whatever your you you got in your 5d world your future self is telling you that you will get it in your 3d world and at that point of time you will feel that oh my god those experiences were so much necessary for me to understand my own value okay i can feel that my group number three that uh, oh my god like you are going to be literally showing your successful self to many people. Your future self is so happy. You know, they are laughing. You know, they are literally partying, partying and enjoying. Your future self is telling you that, oh my God, I'm so happy that uh, we did it. Okay. We literally prove ourselves perfect. We prove ourselves that how powerful we are when we are literally, you know, proving our true self. Oh my God, my group number three, maybe you are someone, you're going to be, you know, you maybe you'll be choosing a new path, you'll be choosing a different direction to make yourself successful. Let's go, what's your future self is telling you? Oh my God, Anima Mundi, you know what Anima Mundi is? This is the most spiritual card ever, maybe you're a psychic, tarot reader, astrologer, witches, um, doing some sort of healing qualities, Reiki healers. You are very much famous or uh, maybe you are doing some sort of spiritual stuff because I can feel this is the most spiritual card ever. This is all about connecting with the divine uh, power, connecting with the divinity. Maybe you are literally becoming very powerful preacher, teacher, uh, preacher, teacher or high priestess or energy of hierophant. Okay, you are literally becoming successful in your career. You are going to be having your own business, own, own place. Okay, so you will be someone that you are so powerful. Others will be thinking that, oh my God, how can you become so powerful? 
how can you be like that okay because this is the this is the card like anima mundi means the soul of the world all that is you are the world you are the one you are the one everything is in you the embrace of anima mundi is available anytime anywhere to anyone day or night rich or poor it is a process of unveiling our resistance to its love anima mundi epitomizes the principle of accept all and reject none simply put it is the living soul of the world in all its multifaceted multidimensional layers bonded together by loving cosmic forces diversity is celebrated okay i can feel like oh my god tending to the sacred details of life anima mundi is the energy behind the world card in the tarot deck both carry themes of universal unity completeness and embrace this when maybe you are becoming world famous maybe you're someone you're becoming the true self that you have always wanted to become so this is a card that your future self is telling you maybe you'll be world famous people will be searching you on the google okay you're going to be the first oh my god i can see my group number two whoever you're watching this video oh my god your school friends your college friends the people that already know you they will be super shocked by knowing your success i don't know what type of success you are getting okay i really don't know you are you are an entrepreneur you are becoming successful you are here to change the world you are here to uh, become the first first something okay like i don't know like entrepreneur a leader a captain you are here to change the world you are the king or the queen my group number 3 your future self is telling you that you don't even know how powerful you are okay your future self is telling you that you know what in the future there will be a time that people will try to give your presence into their life to to make them feel that they are also a celebrity okay maybe you are becoming such a having that you know, famous energy that people will tell that hey i know pile number 3 you know we were together in school hey i know pile number 3 we met in a shopping mall yeah we know pile number 3 we were in a same college or something like that people will try to give your identity to know that oh my god there are also someone very much famous okay pile number 3 this is your message if you are literally watching my video choosing pile number 3 and still listening to this this is definitely for you okay you are becoming super famous then the card that you got that is the vision and you got the prayer and it's amazing that three cards are all about spirituality my group number 3 are becoming spiritual healer successful healer psychic um astrologer you are mystics uh, occult you maybe you are studying about demonology if you are then you are doing great you are someone doing philosophy psychology or maybe you are a doctor okay or you are like a psychologist or you are just you you do you do study of medicine or you do stuff that is quite witchy okay i don't know maybe you are a spell caster which craft you are doing like you can see you have the vision to connect with other dimension i don't know my pile number two what you are doing but your future self is already telling you that your prayer because prayer was very much needed because you choose the tree of life the prayer was very much needed because whatever you want to become that needs some sort of prayer okay i just told you some some certain qualities but let me tell you your future self is telling you that you are becoming exactly the dream version of yourself no matter what you want to become okay it may not be someone very much spiritual it may be someone very much materialistic like a business man business woman actor actress model engineer doctor business or maybe like you know a cook in like uh, very very good in like you know hotel hotel management or hospital management if you want to become a nurse that's okay like someone you want to become my darling my pile number 3 you will do that and you know what your past friends your past people will be shocked by your by your success okay and they will be thinking that is just your luck is just your luck that you got exactly the thing that you are right now or you will be in the future okay people will be literally talking about oh my god my pile number 3 literally got this thing because of um because of the uh, connection because of the power or because of the money or something okay so yes i'm getting that 
your future self is superly powerful definitely there is someone who works with tarot who works with other spirits other you know crystals i can see someone who's very spiritual with this card maybe it's some of my darlings okay and for other of you you're literally becoming someone maybe advisor okay maybe you are doing very good in stock marketing bitcoins or maybe you are like investing your money your time your your knowledge into something but just you know that that business will flourish and just it flourished and you did it okay you got it you got everything that you have always wanted because your dream is quite big my group number three it's like um impossible dream that you're having but i can see growth is here whatever your dream is doesn't matter how impossible it is but it is possible because you got the power in yourself Dear spirit, bring a gentle touch. So I'm sensing that loss of luxuriousness is here because dear is connected to the luxuriousness, connected to the gentleness. So your future self is telling you that be gentle to yourself, be gentle to yourself. You know, when you're loving yourself, caring yourself, you know, your future self is literally telling you that you'll become such a powerful person that you'll be very much gentle to everyone. You will never have any kind of ego or pridefulness for anybody else, okay? You'll be a very gentle person in the future. Electric ill, oh my god, electric ill spirit, bring your ideas into life. Maybe you are someone, you're going to be really innovative and like a creator when it comes to your ideas. Maybe you're going to be literally using your ideas to make something great in your life and great for the world. Maybe you are here in this world because of some reason, because you are here. Maybe you're a scientist watching my video, maybe you're a spiritual healer or a scientist. You are here to make other people... Get a more healthy and happy and non-bothered uh, life, okay? You're going to be helping that. Because bring your ideas into life. Your ideas are something. Your IQ is something. That is that is what you're famous for. Butterfly spirit is here. Transformation is beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. Big, huge transformation. My pile number three, okay? Your future self is telling you that a big, huge, fat transformation that is coming towards you. You will be like a butterfly. You are literally tra transforming into a being that everyone wants to be with you. Everyone wants to, you know, be friend with you. They will literally, you know, give in your identity everywhere so that they can be recognized by others. Oh my God, you are becoming famous. My group number three, I can feel definitely famous, F-A-M-O-U-S, that is the thing that I'm getting famous, you are getting famous, my darling, okay, famous success, recognition, getting revenge, people are looking at you, and you know why those experiences are very much important, your future self is literally feeling so successful that people rejected you in the past, or your future self is feeling so happy that you have been into some kind of a hard moment because that was very much necessary for you. Wow, you are literally smiling for the reason uh, that uh, made you cry in the past. Wow. Oh, my pile number three, I literally love this reading. This is all I got for you. If you literally like this, love this reading, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit that bell icon so that you can notify about you whenever I upload new videos. Comment down below which part is resonating with you also so just any kind of topic i'll definitely do that till then see you guys so much